Hey everybody, my name is Fork and I would like to welcome you back to the Distance Beta for another track showcase. Today's track is Nightmare by BC Powerhouse and it's red. It may look a little bit like um, hardcore black as far as the aesthetic goes, but I can assure you that it's not. I actually did sit through and we, we did have an interview with him, but the footage has gone missing. And we just don't have the time to schedule another run of this, so I can just just trust me when I say, not inspired by hardcore, hardcore black. Now, apart from that, I have pretty good things to say about this track. It's challenging, it's interesting, the visuals are solid, and it's just good fun. It it combines all all the goody goodness. There aren't any sections on this track where. Who, there, there could be closer, um, closer checkpoints or anything like that. There's no overuse of obstacles. And even though this section has quite a few obstacles, including my least favorite of them, a dropper drone, it's honestly not a bad section. I like the touches that are done here. I like the color contrast on the launchers and the spikes. Oh, we got so lucky there. And I just... It, it, ah, that's, that's how it makes you feel, and that's entirely intentional. This part's a little weird, just because, uh, you know, it's really easy to mess up there. And I also like this, how it's kind of hard to see the spires until you get up to them. And then, bam! All of a sudden, it's bright, so I hope that you don't play this track in a dark room, because it's, it gets very, very bright all of a sudden. Um... Oh, and, and the name of the track is Nightmare, so I take it to mean that, like, this is towards towards the end of the Nightmare, you know? It's, the, the sun is coming up or something like that. I'm not really sure, but I like it. I like the use of fog. I like how the colors change, and there's another, um, there was a split back there, and the left path is actually significantly different than the right path, though I don't know if it's any faster. So we'll just have to see what kind of time we get here and compare that and, you know, hopefully I don't completely screw it up. I love this part even though it's very, very easy to screw that up. Because of the turn, it's kind of hard to tell which way is actually down. And I want to be on this side, I think. Yes. See, it's, it's very hard to tell which way is actually down when you first make that jump, so I always end up getting it wrong, especially since there's two different ways that you can go. Though, I, does the arrow on my back tell me which way down is? Am I just a complete a, a, a goof when it comes to that? I, or does it point towards the end of the track? I'm not really sure. Let's go through one more time so that, you know, I can show everything up. And I gotta say, I just think this is cool. My car is actually white. But when I get onto the track, it turns black. I just I just think that's really, really cool. I like the flips here. Um, I like this part as well. I really love the tunnel that it has you going through. Though, there's the second twist that I believe is coming up. That it's, it's really easy to fall off the track there. And we'll see if I can show you what I mean. In some of these, some of these flips, I feel like I'm just... Oh, I'm just bad at them. And here you can explode really easy if you just angle incorrectly on not the road transfer adjusted, but the one before that. And here is no, not quite, not quite. It's it's coming up though. Here it is. It's really easy to just launch into nothingness here. But we gotta turn around and jump! Oh, I, I feel like I got very lucky there. I shouldn't have been able to recover that. But yay, I did it! We come through here and we've got this again. Frickin', frickin' dropper drone! Frick a frickin' dropper drone. Oh, goodness, these spikes. The spikes always make me nervous. Oh, no! Why? Oh, I thought it was... Ah, I turned just a bit too early trying to get some style points. What you gonna do, drone? Get out of my face. That's what you're gonna do. Mm-hmm. I'm the king of this castle. You jerk. Come up through these guys. Do a quick little flip. I wish... Oh, God. 
I think that there could be a cooldown ring here. Um, just to make the flips not... Oh, God. Not awkward. Uh, but then again, maybe I'm just bad at flips. And I kind of wish that Sneeze stayed just pulsating as you came up to him, but I don't know how doable that is. Oh, I got cut by something! Oh, my goodness. I forgot about that. Let's see if we can make it all the way through this. I love the lasers here. I love that they keep their red. I think that that is super freaking cool. Oh, God. Okay, we made it there. Let's not get cut by this next laser. Okay. Oh, that one almost got us. We're good. Oh, God. Oh, goodness gracious. How am I not explode? Oh, why? Did I overheat? I don't know if I overheat. Did I tap select? Oh, I'm an idiot. I, my finger slipped and I tapped select. Oh, well. But yeah, I love the lasers on this part of the track. I kind of wish that there were more of them because they it's a really, really cool contrast. I really, really like the colors here. It, it is, it is. Don't, make, make no mistake. It is bright. But I think that that's totally fine given, you know, it, it thematically fits. So it's totally okay. There are some tracks that just get way too bright for no real reason. Um, this isn't one of them. I, I feel that it fits. And it provides a nice contrast. So we want to be on this side. Come on. There we go. I am the bee's knees MLG and flip. Oh, almost messed that one up. But there you go. That is pretty much the whole track. I would like to thank you guys once again for joining me for another distance track showcase. If you are interested in the... Be sure to check out this track on the Steam Workshop. You can find a link to it in the description below. Be sure to check out my other distance track showcases. There's a playlist on my page. Check it out. If you know of any tracks that I should check out for a track showcase, leave a comment down in the comment section below or shoot me a tweet on the Twitter sphere and I'll be sure to check it out. Also, if you've played this, let me know what you think and try to beat my time. That's a challenge to you, Cyclops. I'll see you guys next time. Bye.